Hey guys, what's going on? Drax here back again with another episode of Scrap Mechanics. Hope you guys are having a good day. I wanted to show you my little car that I got here. It's a pretty neat little car. It's got a little bit of suspension in it, so you can see that I can I can bounce nicely. Yeah, there we go. I have got it so where my doors open up. Yeah, that's pretty neat too, right? Oh, yeah. Um, I've also got this uh, other pretty cool function that uh, even lets my hood, well, nope, that's the wrong one, lets my hood come up and you can see my my engines. So that's pretty cool too, right? Not even close. This is a pretty darn slick car. It is incredibly heavy. <laughs> As you can see, the springs are, are definitely compressed, but if I extend our thrusters, if I fold in our, our okay, let me extend the thrusters. Turn on the thrusters. We get up. Oh, that must be the wall. That's unfortunate. All right, so you can see there that the uh, the wheels actually do fold up underneath. So let's let's try this again. Turn on our thrusters. This thing does not get flight in any way, shape, or form. But there's so much bounce to this game. Like I can't figure it out, but. We almost got a little bit of lift, but I just, I find the mechanics of this car, if I could get it to work, like, you would be, oh, 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 I'm in the wrong seat. There we go. If I could get the mechanics of something like this to work, I think it would be pretty neat, because you have a, a basically just a car, and then you can uh, go and take off. It's, it's almost like something out of James Bond. So um, I don't know what I'm doing wrong precisely. Uh, I haven't quite figured it out. I know there's a lot of weight, so we might want to start to strip some of this weight. And so that probably has a lot to do with it. So why don't we do that? Why don't we strip some weight here? And uh, we'll pull off the top. And we'll see how she does as far as lift is concerned. Yeah, well, as soon as I, I put those down, that's all we get. But I even have, you know, some turning involved with our thrusters. So you can see we've got one going up one way, one going up the other. And uh, even when everything's closed up, it just gives your car a nice little boost. So that you can uh, move around the way that you want to. And it even, I don't know, it's kind of weird. But it seems like it almost counterbalances you from tipping over. But that might just be me. But it's completely just a car. We'll kind of tear it down here a little bit more. So we'll just tear this all off like so. And then we'll just tear this all off. Yeah, there we go. There's that. And then this is all like part of the front end. So we're not going to worry about that. But so you can see our door is still open. Our front end opens. Got our thrusters. And let's go ahead and open those. All right, so in here, that is what does the wheels. And basically, all it's doing is it's just having the wheels fold up and under. So I, it's kind of hard to show. Maybe if I get in the driver's seat, I can show it off. But it just, it just folds them sideways underneath, and then they sit there. And I can actually um, drive like this. Like, it's, it's not a very fast propulsion method, but it is, like, literally driving. But uh, what, what's pretty cool is, like, you can drive, and you fold these up, and, like, you can kind of, like, do a little jig. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, that's I like that part. I think that's pretty darn cool, in my opinion. Um, in here is just, you know, settings for that. Some of the other controllers, like, this one literally folds the wings. Uh, this one up here does... Or that one folds the wings. That does the wheels. These are the boosters. I'm sorry. Yeah. See, that's what that is. That Those are the boosters. And then when the wings fold out, if you notice, the back end opens up to, to show a couple of more thrusters. So that's pretty cool, too. Now, let's uh, close this off. And then uh, let's remove some of this. Because like I said, there's a lot of weight in this vehicle. And if we can remove some of that weight, it might not be too bad. But, you know, it kind of 
defeats the purpose of it being a car because of the amount of stuff that you're removing. But, you know, hey, what you going to do? Sometimes, like I said, some of the stuff, I, you know, there's definitely, there's no, like, propulsion or anything in the game. Um, and I did a lot of that weight stuff to uh, to really even out things uh, with a vehicle like this. But here we go. We can see this. Extend our stuff. Uh, let's put that down. Is that the wall? Oh, darn it. All right. Turn those off. Now the front end is just way too heavy. Turn. Engage thrusters. Still not getting enough lift on this bad boy. And I wonder, you know, I'm kind of a little curious here. That if I rotate this and give it an upward direction, uh, what would happen? Not a whole lot. <laughs> it's trying. Like, it doesn't know what to do. Oh, yep. We're stuck now. Oh, I guess is that not able to, like, close with everything? Oh, it kind of does. But when it's pulling out, it gets stuck. Yeah, unless you turn. That's That's a little funny. I never even looked at that. But let's flip this guy back over. And then we can go ahead and hop back in here. There we go. Extend the, the thrusters. And up, up, and away. Nope, not even close. Still way too heavy. <laughs> All right. Well, I, I still got a lot to learn when it comes to, uh, to flyers and cars and stuff like that. So I hope that you guys like this idea. Like, you know, that's... It's what I do in a lot of my videos is I try to inspire ideas and I, cause I'm not, like I said, I'm not the best when it comes to making stuff like this work. So, um, I have ideas, but I don't have the, uh, execution so to speak. So that's why I look to you guys. I look to see, um, a lot of people have been sending me stuff on Twitter which has been absolutely incredible seeing your guys' creations on Twitter. So if you guys want to do that, please do so. Link uh, to my Twitter is in the description down below, or, or it's at DraxLP. I love seeing you guys' creations. And once we get a, uh, a workshop thing going, I'm definitely going to be showing off the best creations that you guys make because that would just be absolutely incredible. But for now, guys, I hope, oh, I hope that you enjoyed this episode of Scrap Mechanic as much as I did, and I will see you in the next one.